In this video, I'll be using PowerShell to set home page, new tab page, and also enable home button for Brave Browser. I'm starting this video from my GitHub page, and that's because there are a few bits of information here that I will be using for this video, and I will leave the URL in the description down below. And I have one note here, basically, this method works only for the computers that are joined to Active Directory or will be joined in the future. But until the computer is joined, the settings would be inactive. And here I have the PowerShell snippet that I will be using to configure Brave Browser. And it works by creating registry entries in Windows registry. For example, here I'm creating a registry entry to set home page location to google.com. This one is for setting the new tab page to DuckDuckGo. This one is to enable a feature that allows us to have different pages for home page and the new tab page because by default new tab page and home page are the same pages and the last one is to enable the home button in brave browser and now i will click on the button right here to copy the powershell snippet and then i will go to my vmware workstation where i have this windows virtual machine and this windows virtual machine is joined to active directory and that means that the settings should work fine if i open brave now you can see that it opens up the standard starting page for Brave Browser and to configure it, I will go to start menu, I will search for terminal application, I will run it as administrator, here I will enter my credentials and I will insert the PowerShell snippet from the GitHub page and then I will press enter and that's basically it, it seems that the snippet executed successfully. Now if I go back to Brave Browser for the settings to apply, I need to relaunch Brave so I will close it and then I will reopen it. And as you can see, this time it opens up the DuckDuckGo web page because this is the new tab page. Now, if I click on the home button here that appeared also, it brings us to Google. If I open a new tab, it opens up the DuckDuckGo site. And that's basically it for setting up everything with PowerShell. Now, if you want to revert back the changes, you would need to go to Windows registry and remove the registry entries. So for that, I will go back to my terminal application and here I will type regedit. This brings me to the register editor. Here I will go to local machine, software, policies, Brave software and Brave. And here we have the, all the registry entries that were created by the PowerShell snippet. We have the home page is new tab page, home page location, new tab location and show home button. So I'll select all of them and then right click and delete. Now, once again, we need to relaunch Brave for the settings to apply. I will close it and reopen it. And once again, it brings us the new tab page for its starting page. And that's it for this video. Like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And see you in the next one.